Yo, what's going on everybody? My name is Josh. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about some of the pros and cons of the Whisker Seeker rods. Currently I own 13 of their rods, a 7, 7 foot 6 heavy action, as well as 6, 9 foot 6 heavy action rods. As you can tell, spoiler alert, they are my favorite rods. Um, there are so many pros with these that I think we're going to wait till the end to list them. So let's go ahead and start off with con number one. The discoloration of the rods, they start out a really vibrant orange. And as you can tell, after just a handful of uses, they fade down to a really light orange. Con number two, the cork on the handles flake off. Now I've had zero issues with my GFX model rods, but about five to six months in with my full metal jacket rods, the cork just started flaking off for no reason. I know a lot of you guys are going to be like, well, it's probably the rod holders that you use, but these are the rod holders I use and they put zero stress on the cork in any of the spots that it actually flaked off. Now, honestly, guys, that's all my complaints. So let's just hop right into the pros. There's so many pros to these rods that I'm not going to be able to cover them all. So I'm going to tell you the top three reasons why it's my favorite rod. Number one, the size of the rod. That's what she said. I really like the diameter of the Whisker Seeker rods compared to some of the other catfish rods I've used that were just really big around this super thick, uh, bulky fiberglass. Uh, the Whisker Seekers are quite a bit thinner and they just feel great in your hands. Number two, the action of the rods. Now I'm kind of comparing the Whisker Seeker heavy action versus some of the other brand heavy actions that I've used. Um, some of the other brands just feel like a broomstick to be totally honest with you. You know, I know they're not designed for small fish, but if you catch a small fish, you have no clue it's even on there. Um, you go to cast, it kind of feels like a broomstick. Whereas the Whisker Seeker, I mean, they're rated from one to 12 ounces. They'll throw a lead a country mile. And if you catch, I don't know, even a three, four, five pound channel cat, you still get that nice little feel when you're reeling it in. It's one of those things that really you just have to go out there and experience it for yourself. Number three, the balance and feel of the rod. It kind of goes back to one and two. Um, it's that right diameter, the way it feels when you're fighting a fish. They cast a mile. They just feel great in your hands. Now, full disclosure, guys, I'm not sponsored by Whisker Seeker in any sort of fashion. But if somebody from Whisker Seeker happens to see this video and they want to toss me in some free stuff, I won't pass it up. Now, if any of you guys have owned or are thinking about purchasing one of these rods, let us know in the comments below. I want to say thanks for watching. We hope you have a great day. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. 